Okay, guys, so check this out. Ja Rule is reportedly off the hook in the $100 million class action lawsuit stemming from 2017's failed Fire Festival. According to Billboard, Ja Rule, real name Jeffrey Atkins, and Fire Fest chief marketing officer Grant Margolin have been dropped from the ongoing case in an order filed November 7th. Both the Murder, Inc. founder and Margolin were originally dismissed in a July decision by Judge P. Kevin Costell. However, the plaintiff's law firm, Garrigus & Garrigus, filed an appeal to keep Rule and Margolin locked in the case. Although they couldn't prove people were persuaded to purchase tickets for the botched event as a result of Rule's promotional tweet in April. Rule's attorney, Ryan Hayden Smith, said, In July, the court dismissed all fire festival claims against Mr. Atkins. After his loss, plaintiff's law firm, Garrigus & Garrigus, appealed that decision and the court denied their appeal. This ruling is nothing short of a total vindication of Mr. Atkins. Fire Festival and its founder, Billy McFarlane, are still facing the class action lawsuit against them. McFarlane was sentenced to six years behind bars for wire fraud in October 2018. So what do you guys think? Should Ja Rule have been somewhat at fault in the situation or getting off scot-free was the right outcome? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. Hit that subscribe button and notification bell to stay up to date on all of our new videos. And as always, make sure to keep it all the way locked to hiphopdx.com.